Hello everybody, this is Faith from Firestone Tarot. I hope you are all well. If you're new to my little channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. Pisces, I apologize. I was in the middle of your reading last night when I, uh, how do we put this? Completely zoned out right in the middle of the reading and just totally lost all concentration. So you know what? I need to go to bed. By that point, it was after midnight, so you know what? I, I can't do this anymore, and if it's another 12 hours late and a decent reading, I don't think they'll mind. Anything's better than watching me just sitting here for five minutes completely zoned out, so. All right, this will be Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the end of April. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with message you and the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it is your journey and I'm on it. Just read the cards. If it does not resonate, that's okay. It's a general reading. It's not going to resonate with every Pisces. You can throw it all together or check your moon rising or Venus sign readings. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. And all things can and maybe vice versa. And they play out from the first part of a cross watch. And you guys are welcome here too. Come on in have a seat. I appreciate you. Okay. One more. I'm being told one more. All right. Pisces, why are you here? Strength in the reverse. A little bit drained. Something has y'all drained. How do you feel with the person you're dealing with? Four of Cups in the reverse. You feel like the person you're dealing with is ignoring something. In a minute, we'll see what they're ignoring. What do you think of them? Three of Wands. You see them as a patient person. You could think that they're willing to wait. What do you want from them? Two of Pentacles in the upright. You want a balanced connection. Okay. How do they feel about you? Justice in the reverse. They don't feel that you are a fair person. They feel that you are imbalanced. What do they think of you? Six of Wands in the reverse. They could see you as slightly cocky. Okay. What do they want from you? Seven of Cups. Something about options. They could want you to keep your options open, or they want to be able to keep their options open. What's the challenge here? Ace of Pentacles. The challenge here is making that new abundant start. Could be a start over. What can be done? Nine of Swords in the reverse. Someone could be overthinking this. Could kind of be going bat poop bonkers, even. Potential outcome. Magician in the reverse. It's just not manifesting. It's just not getting going. Potential outcome is it going absolutely nowhere. All right. Let's clarify with the Tarot Illuminati today.
Universe, Source, and Spirits. Can I get some clarity on the cards on the table for Pisces for their end of April reading, please? I didn't ask anything yet. <laughs> Six of Swords in the reverse. Someone may be trying to make a return. Maybe that's the draining part. The challenge here is a new start, so... Why is the Four of Cups reversed here? I'm not going to clarify them all. I'm just going to clarify the questionable ones. Why is the Four of Cups reversed here? The lovers, you feel like they're ignoring the connection. Why is justice reversed here? Thanks, High Priestess. They feel that this was unfair and unjust. The High Priestess can indicate secrets. Perhaps there were secrets involved here. There was lies and deception. Perhaps they're going with a gut feeling that something was not right. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Princess of Swords in the reverse. Hierophant in the reverse. Challenge here is the new start. There's no communication. And there's been a breakdown in a blessed union. This could have been an engagement. This is very reminiscent of a, of a reading that happened about a year ago. Now that I think about it. Yeah. This is like bringing back memories, y'all. <laughs> okay. The challenge here is this, this may not have been meant to be, but you're no longer on speaking terms. That's inhibiting the whole idea of the new start, the do-over. I think this relationship was extremely draining. And it is now even more draining that someone may be trying to make a return. That's been happening a lot too. As of late, I'm hearing a lot of stories of exes coming back to haunt people. Why is the Nine of Swords reversed here? 
for what can be done. Three of Swords. Heartbreak. I'm going to call for one more on that. <laughs> Three of Wands in the reverse. Don't hold your breath. That's two threes. There may still be a third party involved in this somewhere. What can be done here is don't give it a second thought because this hurts. Don't wait. Don't take action. Don't do anything. Just walk away from the dock. Walk away. Walk away. I'm hearing a very strong walk away. Why is the Magician reverse chair? Double reversed. That changes things because this is not just this not manifesting. This is somebody who's trying to be manipulative and pull puppet strings. There's obsession here, there's toxicity. Pisces, somebody may be trying to pull your strings. They know how to get to you. They know what buttons to push. They want to be seen as an option. Why's well, two of pentacles here? Prince of Wands. Let's throw another one on that. Seven of Swords reversed. You want them to regain balance. You 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 want them you want them to stop with their lion player ways. You want to level the playing field. When you throw a clarifier on it, it, it kind of changes the meaning a little. I don't think this connection was meant to be Pisces. I don't. I think this drains you very heavily. I think it hurt when it disconnected. I think you've gone a minute. I think you've gone more than a minute being just fine without this person. But at the same time, all things being vice versa, 
Either you thought they were waiting, or you thought they were laying in wait. Two very different things. They think you're a little bit cocky. I'm going to throw a card on that Six of Wands. Just when I say I'm not going to clarify them all. Thank you. Four of Swords reversed. You're restless. You're cocky. You're restless. This has you all upset. This has you drained. You're still getting through the heartbreak. Why is the Three of Wands here? Prince of Pentacles. They think eventually you're going to come back and apologize. I'm sorry. You think eventually they're going to come back and apologize. Or you think they're waiting for an apology. Wow. Pisces. It's all about the he said, she said, and whatever sex, whatever. Bottom line, I don't believe it was meant to be. I believe it disconnected for a reason. And if it reconnects, cool. If it doesn't, still cool. Because I think this may have been slightly toxic from, from the get-go and draining. Sorry, I gotta check this. <laughs> Nothing important. All right. Bottom line, Pisces, somebody's coming back to pull strings. Temperance in the Five of Cups. Definitely an energy flow between you. And until that energy flow is positive, don't do anything with it. If it's still like you're at each other's throats, just leave it alone. Walk away. Walk away from the dock. Let it go. It, it, if you're able to sit down and have a cordial conversation and have it be genuinely cordial and not somebody's putting on a face. Okay, fine. But until it's positive energy, don't do anything with it. And this isn't just a matter of kicked over cups. There's a lesson to be had here. There's blessings in this. And I think those blessings were indeed a very important life lesson. You'll never refill those cups. But there's two cups back here you can pick up and walk away with. I think what's been done has been done. Let's see what this one has to say. The Seven of Wands and the Six of Swords. You're drained, this may cause a little bit of an internal struggle. The only one with the power and control over this situation is you. Or y'all. And it may just be best to pack up that bow of swords and float across the river, down the river, float away, walk away from it, move on. Take the memories with you. Just let it go. Okay, Pisces. And I apologize for the delay. Know that you loved. Be blessed. Take care. I will be back in about a week, week and a half or so for your first half of May reading. I'd like to get all 12 done by the 30th. I'm going to try like hell. We'll see what happens. 
and I will definitely be back Thursday night and or Friday morning for the weekend top and bottom reading. Thanks a bunch. Thanks for your patience. Thanks for the time you took to watch this reading today. Take care, and we'll see you soon. Love you to bits.